Hey there, welcome back to Living Gracefully. Today I'm going to take you to Georgetown and show you a few restaurants and places to eat that are vegan friendly. So first off here is Falafel Inc. And it is the cheapest place you'll probably find in Georgetown and it's the best tasting falafels I've ever had. So along with falafels, they also have sides like cucumber salad and tabbouleh salad, I believe. And they have these wonderful sauces uh, that can add some more flavor to your falafel. Um, so the thing about this place is that it has very limited seating. And so most likely you'll have to take it to go. So these are the falafels and the fries are the tar fries, which are amazing. Um, the falafels are gluten free and they're incredibly tasty. You must try these. As I was walking to the next spot, I found this um, taste of waffles place that has vegan options. So didn't go in here, but it's worth uh, checking out if you are into waffles or it looks like they had purple tea as well. So now I'm walking to Georgetown Cupcakes and this is a very popular place. So you'll most likely have to wait in line to get in as they do have a TV show. Um, but the cupcakes here, they rotate between a carrot cupcake and an apple cinnamon cupcake. Today they have the apple cinnamon cupcake, so that's the one that I got. And these are very, very good. They are worth the wait, they're worth the price. I believe it's around $3.50. And um, yeah, they're delicious. So I'm just here waiting for my cupcake and this is what it looks like. The frosting is very good. It's like a little bit mm, sweet and tart and the apple cupcake is amazing it's really really good all right so i then got starbucks <laughs> and this isn't really like a special thing but um they had the dragon drink which i wanted to have and try again and i got this like really cute mermaid cup that i wanted to show you guys reusable cup and super cute so why not so this is just a little bit around georgetown by the river All right, so next up we have uh, Sprinkles here. And Sprinkles is a well-known um, cupcake place. <laughs> and they do have a vegan cupcake, just one, and it's the red velvet cupcake, which looks like this. And it has a little V on the top, which is adorable. It's really, really good. The frosting is very good, but it's very coconutty. I believe it's made with coconut oil. So if you don't like coconut oil, a uh, coconut flavor, then this might not be it for you. But the cupcake is really good. It's really moist, but it does have a lot of coconut taste. Not necessarily food related, but I wanted to show you that Amazon books uh, bookshop here, and it's really cute. Um, I don't know how common this is in other places, but this is the first one that I saw, and I thought it, it was great. <laughs> they have a little coffee shop and books from Amazon, so I love that. And then, of course, Lush, one of my favorite places. Most of their um, items are vegan or vegetarian. Some of them do contain honey or um, yogurt or milk, but... Um, a lot of items are vegan and they are wonderful. I would highly suggest the body butters. They are amazing. And to keep my skin moisturized uh, and I don't have to put lotion on after my shower. So those are great. <laughs> um, so many things here are really wonderful. So make sure to stop in, stop by and give it a try. All right. Last but definitely not least, one of my favorite, favorite places. This is um, called Paradiso Pizzeria, or yes, yes, Paradiso Pizzeria. And um, it has one of the best pizzas. Like if I suggest this to a friend and they come in and they don't like it, my feelings get hurt. That's how much I love it. So um, they have all kinds of pizzas. It's uh, wood fired. I usually get the margarita one because I am simple like that, but you can get all kinds of veggies in there. I think there's the pizza that has mostly vegetables. You just uh, sub the cheese for vegan cheese, which they do have. They also have a gluten-free uh, crust. I'm not sure if it's vegan, you could ask, but the regular crust is vegan. So that's what I get, and this is what it looks like. 
you can eat there. I believe there's two levels. Or you can take it out and enjoy it by the river. So this is one of the pictures that I posted on my Instagram some time ago. And I hope it makes you want to come by and try it out because every time I see this picture, I want to have it again. <laughs> um, it is that good, you guys. It's seriously, seriously one of the best pizzas. Thank you for watching. I hope you have enjoyed my video. Um, if you do come to DC, make sure to give Georgetown a visit. It is a beautiful place with beautiful stores and a lot of people watching. <laughs> so these are the, some of the places that I visited on this, uh, this time around and I hope you enjoyed seeing them. Make sure to try out at least one of these things. They are amazing and the best thing is that vegan options are popping out everywhere. So I might have an update soon, right? <laughs> Make sure you're following me on Instagram on living gracefully with two Y's. And don't forget to aim for kindness to every kind in your daily life. See you in the next video.